Hey guys and gals, I'm Color Farty, and welcome back to Lemmings Revolution. We've actually gotten through all the tutorial levels now, so hopefully the game will get a bit more interesting. We're on a long and lonely road. 30 lemmings, we can kill 10 of them. This is one of my favorite levels. I love the background area. A lot of people on the Lemmings forums, I'm guessing, will not like this level because it's a lot of building. But I personally do not mind building at all. Oh, whoops. No hotkeys, that's getting annoying. Even the original Lemmings had a one-up over this. So you could bring two Lemmings with you, or you can just use a single builder to build up here. So you can see the interface is actually pretty cool. At least I like it. Whew. Oh no, 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 no. Darn it, he's gonna splat. Oh, he's not gonna splat. I love you, Lemmy, I love you. Oh, little Lemmy. And hey, what the heck? Alright, fine. Uh, and F I keep forgetting. Pause now is P, not F11. No, no, no. Pause is the only thing in the game that has a hotkey and it's getting annoying. I've noticed there are a lot of arrow walls in this, even when it's not necessary. Okay, that basket can be annoying because it can block your view of the lemmings and your ability to assign tasks. Everybody go to the exit! Alright, I remember that level being better than it actually is. And it takes like 10 seconds to load the first you beat a level. Only the first time, though, so that's nice. And now we are on Lems and Loggerheads. If memory serves, this is a walk bombing level. No, it's not. Oh, I remember this level. This is not fun. Let's try building from that convenient little crease. No! Well, that's alright, because I've got another floater. Oh, I forgot. I can do this. Zoom in. I totally glanced over that. Useful feature, though. Oh no, they're gonna splat, aren't they? They didn't splat. Yeah, this doesn't even have directional select. Lemons and walker heads. Okay, there's a more annoying version of this level that involves walk bombing. We'll get to that like a lot. Blah blah blah. We will get to that later. And man, this game is loud. I'm turning the volume down. 
Alright, we are now on the next column, starting with the Abyss. Looks intimidating, but it actually is not. Come on, load! How many lemmings are there? I wish there was a way to check that. Oh well. Everybody walk out. Yeah, I'll show you guys. They're gonna fall on that guy's head. They will literally walk- Yep, see? They walked on his head. Fuck! I really hope there's only 15 lemmings. Good, excellent. Oh, that's right. This is actually a super easy level. I'm sure there's a way if you want to save everyone on that level. You did a great job. You really did. Awesome dude, totally storm that level. Now we're going to crisscross. I don't think that's spelled right, but that's just me. Man, the loading screens are getting on my nerves. <laughs> Mainly just because I'm used to them not being this long. Oh, that's right. So, just to kind of run you through the level, these guys, we're going to have to block down here and then block. Then somewhere block down here, then they'll tr be trapped there. Whereas the water lemmings, they're going to have to be blocked. Actually, wait. Things just got interesting. Alright, let's crank up all these little guys. Whoa, okay. Wow. I don't remember this level being like this. Oh, actually, no, I kind of do. I'm thinking of a different level. Never mind. Come on, load! Oh my gosh, you've loaded this before. I need to rethink my strategy, methinks. I think I see it. Bum, 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 boom, boom, boom.
pausing is going to be my best friend in this game. Yeah, you saw he just walked right by that balloon. What the heck? I literally barely clicked it and it made it fast forward for a long time. That's annoying. Yeah, that's really annoying. Okay, as long as you can click it once, and then no matter how long you click it, it'll always just fast forward. Wow. Fast forward's annoying in this. There should just be a key. But you hold the key down, and it fast forwards, you release it, it stops fast forwarding. That's gonna get annoying eventually. Sergeant Bash. If memory serves, this is this introduces the uh, spike trap, like the rotating spike trap. Yep, it sure does. So see this nasty little piece of work? It's rotating around. So it's just something you want to watch out for. Yeah. That's fun when the saw blade comes out like that. How many do I have to save on this? Oh, I can kill ten of them? Okay. This, I guess, is just an introduction to the spike trap. Come on! Oh my gosh, with the loading screens. It's at 100% for like 10 seconds before it loads. Yeah, it's a pretty basic level. Just kind of, kind of introduces you to this trap. All right. Well, you can't deny the levels are getting a bit more exciting. A bit. <laughs> Alright, what level are we on now? The Crowded House! Oh, that's right. This lives up to its name. This is what I thought Seafood Sarnie was, but nope. Kind of a similar looking level, though. I think there's a crab on it. Come on! Yeah, there's a crab. Okay. Alright, let me see... Nice basket there. What the? No! What? I wasn't even touching the, like, opening box. Oh, this game's gonna drive me insane on the later levels where you constantly have to restart and it takes like 20 seconds to do so.
Yeah, like, I am not even remotely close to the opening box, and I can't click on any lemmings from right here. That's really gonna get annoying. Ooh, that's gonna be nice. So we're already dealing with much more complicated solutions than uh, you'd expect for the very beginning of the game. Of course. I wish there was a real quick restart button that didn't involve us having to load the stage again. That would be great! But no. Stickers in this uh, have very weird movements, I've noticed. Build, build, build! That's very well done on the designer's part, timing that perfectly so you can do it in free bridges. That's very nice. There we go, no splatting. Woot! Crowded house is done! I did like that level, that was fun. We are making pretty good progress for the game, I will say. One way ticket. Sounds. I remember the name of this level, I don't remember which level this is, though. Is this... The one that introduces portals? No. That's right! This level's interesting. I remember this level being pretty cool, honestly. Ah, uh, really? This, yeah, we're already having to use, like, walking bombing. Well, we don't have to, but we have to use bombers to destroy terrain. 
Alright, mob of lemmings, please come over here. This'll be fun. Come on, yeah, alright. Man, it is really annoying when you cannot assign a builder another builder. What? No! Okay. The cursor in this is completely messed up. Like, absolutely, completely, 100% messed up. I clicked right in the dead center of the cursor, and then the corner of the cursor highlighted a lemming. And let him go. Makes no sense. Okay, this is getting absolutely ridiculous. Yeah, like, look at that! I am highlighting a lemming dead center, and it's highlighting a lemming that is not even on the cursor! Wait, there is directional movement? Oh, man. You have got to be kidding me right now. This is so dumb. It's like, oh, no. One more. Well, I mean, I guess that's the same way in regular what I means, but it sure looks like they should be able to climb up that. Maybe they can't climb for the ceiling anymore. Oh, yeah. Okay. At least this is good music now. This is some of the catchiest Lemmings Revolution music there is. No, oh my gosh, I can't believe I clicked that in time. Into the pit, it burns. I think I'll make a blocker first. Okay. Let's try this again. Well, we're about to figure out if they can climb up. Yeah, they could climb up at that time. This is where the lo This game does have a very steep difficulty learning curve, I will admit. You know what? I think in the next video I'm going to stop using my trackpad and start using my optical mouse.
Well, one way to... Oh, thank you for putting this gap in the steel there. It's also weird the bridges change color depending on the terrain. Alright, everyone please go to the exit. Thank you, that level was such a pain. <sighs> Next level I believe is a pain as well. Swings both ways? Swings both ways. You can only kill four, that's important here. Come on, loading screen. Please? Yay. Yeah, water lemmings are back. This is what I thought crisscross was. Alright. So as you can see, we're gonna put a blocker there. We're gonna put a blocker there. And then we're going to have one lemming build over this and one lemming build over that. Then we're going to have See, I actually this is actually a pretty cool level. Put blockers behind them. Ah, uh, what the heck just happened? Stopped bashing for some reason. That's fine. Uh, that was not what I intended to happen. And now, because you can only kill four- what the heck, the fast forward fiend is messing up my groove again. Seriously, for crying out loud, where's the last floater? This is not funny anymore. What the heck? Okay, sometimes Lemon's Revolution is so unbelievably infuriating. Like when it doesn't do what it's supposed to. And I have to find out which one that has left has to be a floater. I see you. Oh my gosh. See, that level could have been cool, it's just... It wasn't! But, we've made it farther in Lemmings Revolution. Maybe I won't be able to beat it. Because, wow. The levels are already getting insane. Well, thanks for watching, I'm Colorful Arnie, and I hope to see you for the next episode, where things will get even more exciting. And we're going to be playing Wandering Free. Have a great day, and God bless.